Melanie Safka, born in 1947, rose to fame after her performance at Woodstock in 1969, marking a turning point in her career. Despite initial albums that didn't gain much attention, the festival provided a platform for her soulful voice and countercultural anthems. Her third album, Candles in the Rain, released in 1970, included the hit Laid Down Candles in the Rain, a soul gospel anthem featuring the Edwin Hawkins singers. The album showcased Melanie's vocal range and included cover versions of songs like James Taylor's Carolina in My Mind and the Rolling Stones' Ruby Tuesday. Another notable piece was the song What Have They Done To My Song Ma, partly sung in French, which became a trademark piece for her. In 1971, Melanie achieved her biggest hit with Brand New Key, reaching the top of the US chart and no. 4 in the UK. Born in Queens, New York, Melanie's eclectic musical influences ranged from blues and jazz to Kurt Vile and Edith Piaf. Raised by her mother, a jazz singer, Melanie's talent was evident from a young age, winning her first talent contest at four. Her entry into the music industry occurred by chance when a Broadway audition led to a recording contract with Columbia Records, later transferred to Butter. After her Woodstock breakthrough, Melanie continued to perform at various festivals, including the Isle of Wight and Glastonbury. Her 1971 album, Gather Me, featured Brand New Key and achieved success on both sides of the Atlantic. In 1989, she received an Emmy Award for her song The First Time I Loved Forever, the theme from the TV series Beauty and the Beast. Melanie's personal life intertwined with her career as she married her producer, Peter Shekerick, and they had three children. Peter's death in 2010 prompted Melanie to write the music for a stage musical about their life. Despite mixed feelings about the cute image associated with Brand New Key, Melanie's impact on the music industry endured until her death on January 23, 2024, at the age of 76. She is survived by two daughters, Leela and Geordie, and a son, Beau.